So, can I just ask Damon Hill, do you know your postman personally? Yes. Would you say that he's the most wonderful man? I don't man? know his name, but I'll say hello to him in the morning. Every morning. They're very the important usual, people, aren't they? Very important yes. people. Yes, well, we're going to show just why in a moment. Uh -huh. Sit back. Explain. Thank you. I've never had such a build-up before. That's wonderful. Thank you very much. Sit there, Giles. Oh, yes, Behave I will. Right. <clears throat> now, it's, it's nearly time to tell you who's been voted, 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 post, so exciting, I'm losing my way, who's been voted Postman of the Year, which is a competition that's been run jointly by the Post Office and TVAM. Well, all the regional finalists are going to be here, and in a moment they'll be entertaining with, with a special song. But first, let's uh, have a look back at what happened last night, when at London's Westmoreland Hotel, all the candidates gathered to go before the judging panel. For each of the contestants, this was the final hurdle. At stake was a prize of a luxury holiday for four people, worth up to £1,700. No wonder they were taking it very seriously. Well, then Nick and I took our turn to meet the contenders, a chance for a few photographs and a few stories. I'm Dan Hilton and I'm the Whistling Postman, and I'll give you a song. <laughs> This old farmer, like, you know, this people, 150, like, you know, he was up this bank in his tractor. And as I was coming down the bank, he stopped this, the bank was on a slope, so I couldn't see down. He told us up, there's a wagon coming up. So I stopped, I pulled over, I was there about five minutes there. I glanced up, I mean, I seen him starting to smile, like, you know, and I thought, I've been out here. I says, where's this wagon? He says, it's coming up sometime this morning. Well, I've got a red setter and he pinned me and the milkman against the door, against the wall one morning. So anyhow, every day now, I put a bone in my pocket. Well, my technique is simply to face the dog and back slowly away. The craziest thing, actually, is uh, being nominated for this. I think that is because it was, I still thought it was a game for a laugh or something, I thought it was a big joke. It's good night, I tell you, really good night. I'm very tired this morning, Anne's even tireder, I told her. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for is we're going to choose the winner of the 1985 Postman of the Year competition. This is the moment. It's in here. So I hope this works. It's a dramatic way of doing it, isn't it? Come on. We'll be having a fanfare in a moment, won't we? <laughs> Here is the envelope. And we are now going to announce officially who is the 1985 Postman of the Year. Fanfare, please. It came at last, and the 1985 Postman of the Year is Bill Smith from Londonderry. Bill, many congratulations. Well done. May I just say that everyone here is a regional winner. They've done brilliantly to get this far, the ten regional winners. Bill has become the national winner, and how do you feel about all that? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> absolutely amazed. Yes. And how long have you been in London, Derry? Because you're not uh, from Ireland originally, no, I'm are you? Not, I'm, I've been in there for about 28 years, nearly 30 years. Now. Yes, and the lady who nominated you nominated you because you were such a caring person when she suffered a time of uh, family bereavement, right? right yeah. But also beyond that, you have another dimension to your job that you have to deal with Protestant and Catholic areas, yes, and it can well, get got the two pretty up. difficult, can't it? Well, it can, but if you're sensible, it'll work out. Yeah, but well, just tell us some of the things you've been through. I mean, you actually have to sort of uh, negotiate fairly hairy circumstances. Well, indeed. Well, in the start of the Troubles, it was really bad. You was going through petrol bombs and stone attacks and shot and shell in all directions, but we always got through all right. Yeah. Well, it's great to see you. Many congratulations, Bill. And as I say, congratulations to all of you. And thanks for Thank coming you. along. And thanks for making us so welcome last night. We had a great time. We're going to hear a song from you later on, aren't we? Well, we dread, uh, look forward to that. <laughs> Thanks a lot. We'll take a break.